NASA asteroid 2002 NN4, this celestial space rock is to zoom past our Earth this weekend. NASA reveals an asteroid the size of a football field is set to make a close approach to Earth this weekend, traveling at 20,000 kilometers per hour. Asteroid 2002 NN4, or 163348, is scheduled to zoom past our Earth this Saturday, June 6th, in what NASA described as a near-Earth object, potentially hazardous asteroid, NEOPHA. The asteroid is between 250 meters and 570 meters, or about, what, 1,300 feet across, making it significantly larger than the Shard of London, which stands at uh, about 1,000 meters tall. It's close, uh, 1,000 feet tall. Its closest approach asteroid 2002 NN4 will be just 0 0.3034 astronomical units. One AU is one, the distance between the Sun and the Earth. That is about 93 million miles. So come Saturday, the asteroid will be about 5 million some odd kilometers from our planet. That's about 3.1 million miles. And NASA describes this asteroid as a near-Earth object, NEO, allowing the space agency to study the history of our solar system. NASA set on its Jet Propulsion Laboratory website, it says NEO, NEOs are comets and asteroids that have been nudged by the gravitational attraction of nearby planets into orbits that allow them to enter our Earth's neighborhood. The scientific interest in comets and asteroids is due largely to their status as the relatively unchanged remnant debris from the solar system formation process about 4.6 billion years ago. Now, the uh, giant outer planets Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune formed from an agglomeration of billions of comets and the leftover bits and pieces and debris from the formation process are the comets we see today. Also today's asteroids are the bits and pieces left over from the initial agglomeration of the inner planets that include Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. NASA also classed it as potentially hazardous asteroid, PHA, stating that potentially hazardous asteroids are currently defined based on parameters that measure the asteroid's potential to make threatening close approaches to Earth. Specifically, all asteroids with a minimum orbit intersection distance of 0 0.05 AU or less are considered PHAs. But this asteroid poses no threat to our Earth. Ian O'Neill of NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory said, in short, 2002 NN4 is a very well-known asteroid with a known orbit that will pass Earth at a very safe distance, while the chances of a major asteroid hitting Earth are small. NASA believes there is a 1 in 300,000 chance every year that a space rock which could cause regional damage will hit. The devastating prospect is not impossible, but there are some plans on the go which could help Earth against potential hazardous asteroid strikes. Now, NASA is currently studying asteroid Bennu, where the Osiris Rex spacecraft will arrive, uh, it did arrive actually in 2018. Part of the reason NASA is sending Osiris Rex spacecraft is to gather more information about the rock, which is about 1,640 feet in length. NASA fears the asteroid, which has the potential to wipe out a country on Earth, could hit our planet within the next 120 years with the next close flyby being in 2135. The mission will give vital information as to how to deflect asteroids from their collision course with Earth, but NASA reiterates while there is a small chance Earth could be impacted over millions of years of all the planets, Bennu, they say, is most likely to hit Venus. And that's what they, uh, they predict. They're still going to, of course, examine the Material found on Bennu brings them back to Earth to find out what it's made of and how to mitigate such asteroids. This is by Express UK, Sean Martin.
If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece, in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.